Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I am Molisani Palanda. If it's your first time coming in here, I welcome you. So in today's channel, I'm going to be showing you guys how I apply this simple eyeshadow look. Now before we go any further, kindly hit the subscribe button, hit the thumbs up button and don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you don't get to miss out on any video that I apply. So guys, as you can see, I am coming to you with a face that is already done but not yet completed. As you can see that um, the powder is still on my face. So as you can see, I'm going to apply a concealer from Candid. If you do not have a concealer, you can actually use a an eyeshadow base you go ahead and blend the concealer until it becomes nice and smooth now the a the eye is actually divided into different parts there is the transition the crease where the eye falls when you look up and there's a lid together with the outer corner and the inner corners so it's important for you to know which colors or what type of colors are supposed to be applied in those particular um, parts of the eye. So I'm going to use this um, eyeshadow palette from, from colors. I'm going to use that deep purple using a fluffy brush. Now instead of swiping i'm actually going to be packing so i'm going to be packing that color from the inner parts of the eye towards the outer parts of the eye my camera is losing focus here my daughter I want to blend out the color that I've applied so I decided I'm going to clean the brush just to create a fade on that colors Now for my transitioning color, I want to use that pink uh, coming from another palette from Colors. They call it hot pink. Those, those shades do not have names. So it's important that you actually dust off the excess. I'm going to apply the color pink just at the at the edges of that purple color.
now that I am done picking the color hot pink I am going to actually blend the edges of the color pink so that it can also become smooth and nice for me those are the principles of blending you only blend the edges until everything looks perfect and another thing that you need to take care of when you're going to blend is to use clean brush make sure that on your brush there is no other colors left from your previous blending because if there are any colors that are left that can actually affect the results of your eyeshadow look So I'm going back to that um, color purple. The reason being that as you blend, you will realize that sometimes the color tends to to fade because the the colors actually get mixed. So I went back and picked the color purple and pack it where I picked it before. I also did the same with pink. I went back to pink and also did the same thing.
now that i am done with applying the eyeshadows on both the eyes i'm actually going to use that shimmering shade shade your penya penya i'm going to apply it at the highest um point of my eyebrow they call it a brow bone Now moving on to the bottom parts of the eyes, I am going to apply that uh, dark purple shade at the waterline. You should be careful with this step, you do not want to disturb your eyes. To blend out the purple color, I'm actually going to take the hot pink and apply it at the edges of the purple shade to blend out that purple shade just like what we did at the top. That is how you actually achieve a very simple and yet a beautiful eye look. I hope you guys have learned something from this video. Kindly hit the subscribe button, share, hit the thumbs up button. Thank you so very much until we meet each other next time. Bye.